Good evening doctors. My name is Dr. Vishnu. Today I am going to teach you about uterine fibroids. Let's make it very easy. What is uterine fibroids? And in my next video we are going to solve the MCQs about uterine fibroids for PG examination like in NEET PG and AIMS. Let's start. Uterine fibroid. You see here, it's we can say leomyomas, myoma, fibromyoma, leofibrolioma, fibroleomyoma. This is same uterine fibroids name. These are estrogen dependent tumor. Estrogen dependent, you see here. Yeah, estrogen dependent. Then uterine fibroids are benign, smooth muscle tumor of uterus they are usually benign they undergo in malignant changes only very few percent 0 0.5 5 percent so many times this question they ask if we go in sign and symptoms it causes a uterine bleeding you see here yeah i write uterine bleeding like menorrhagia infertility it causes Cause if we know genetics like familial leomyoma, that is autosomal dominant. If we go in types, they are just interested to know only superficial things about uterine fibroids in examination. Any, so we are going to learn here only some superficial basic knowledge. Most common type is intramural. Intramural. Intramural is can undergo in malignant potential as we see here. Yeah, in subserosal that can undergo in calcareous degeneration and malignant patch. See some mucosal, some mucosal causes bleeding and infertility, and cervical posterior cervical fibroids on the wall of cervix causes retention of urine. You see here which I write these are the types of uterine fibroids important thing to remember intramural is the most common type it can undergo in malignant potential subserosal calcareous degeneration malignant potential but submucosal is for bleeding and infertility you need to remember this thing